Hey Purse Besties, it's me Denise and today I'm going to show you two of my juicy bags, my newest juicy bags that I've gotten. I've only worn one of them I think two times but it's already getting dirty and the other one I haven't worn at all. But the reason that I'm going to show you both of these juicy bags are because they're both daydreamers but one of them is real and one of them is fake. So I'm going to show you the differences between these two just in case you happen to come across so, them. The first one that I'm going to show you is this one which is my pink and gray Juicy Couture Daydreamer and it's really cute. It has the scurry dogs and it says Juicy Couture born in the glamorous USA. The leather is like shiny and the embroidery is really nice. I really love the embroidery and um, it still has a tag on it because I haven't um, used it yet but this is how the tag looks front and this is the back of the tag and as you can see the handles here are um, basically like a I don't know, I guess you would say patent leather because it's not real leather. And also the trimming is not like real leather. So I just, I, I don't really know. I would just say patent leather because to me it's play leather. It's pleather like. And the back has the J. And the pink is just really cute. I love this. And it's a daydreamer so the side of it has that pocket right here. And the bow. So then on to the inside, you open it and it has like a zipper closure and the zipper has a J. And then when you go inside, it looks like this inside. And so basically it has a spot where it says shop and it has the little J. And then on the other side, it has the spots where it says, hello. And so I guess you would put your cell phone in this one and you could probably put your lip gloss or something on this in this one. So that's that. And then it has the inside uh, tag that says Juicy Couture. And inside of here, there's nothing. It's just plain. So if you didn't realize it by now, this is my fake Juicy Couture bag. And this fake Juicy Couture bag cost me $50. It was $49.99. So I mean, fake Juicy Couture bags, they still cost, but just not as much. And it's still really cute. I'm still going to rock it. It has like this little heart and it has um, these little embellishments right here. They're still really cute and I'm still going to rock it. $49.99 bag is still expensive. And so that's the fake one. So then one, here right? goes my real one. So this one I bought at the actual Juice Couture store. And I know how to tell real from fake anyways. This one is the real one and I'll show you everything about it. So the front of it, <clears throat> the front of it has the Juicy Couture and it has the Scotty Dogs and it's like, it's like as if the, um, this part right here was like ironed on because that's how it feels and looks. So it's not stitched or anything and this is like an old school Juicy Couture bag but they're still selling it. And I really, I always wanted one of these. I actually have a gray one. I think I showed you guys, but it's a little bit different. But I always wanted a pink one. So I got this one at the actual store, and they were having a really good deal. I think it was either 30% off or 50% off. So I ended up paying like either $70 or $80 for this bag. So that's not bad for a real Juicy Couture bag at all. And plus tax. So that's that. And then the back has nothing. It's plain. I already have a couple dirt marks on it because this pink is really hard to clean. And then the side has the pocket. 
and the bow. And then the handles are real leather. It's not shiny leather. It's not leather or fake leather. And so I love the handles. They're really cute and, you know, sturdy. And then for the opening, it's a magnetic open enclosure. And then for the inside, you just have the regular um, Juicy Couture, you know, the regular Juicy Couture work and the zipper with the J symbol on it, but it doesn't say shop or anything like that, just regular. And then there's no other pockets, only that one. And then the inside tag is this one, which is the small one. This is real. And then inside here will be your other ticket to let you know that you have a real bag. And it's just that. It should say whatever the style and model number is. And then it should also have a date to let you know when the bag really came out. So... I just got this bag last month, but this bag is, you know, actually a 2012 season. So that's probably why they were having a sale. So now I'm going to show you the difference between the bags. So I have both bags here. And these are my Juicy Couture babies. I love them. I've only been using this one, though. I really love this one because I always wanted that color. But I love this color, too. We have the handles. So... For starters, this handle is real leather, and you can see let me get that off. You can see that it's real. It's not plastic, plasticky or shiny. And this handle right here is not real leather. It's the plasticky, shiny leather. So those are the differences between those two daydreamer bags. And then also on this one, it has the studs, you know, right here, and this one it doesn't. But they both still have like the, this one is brass for the real one, for the little buckle here, and this one is gold tone. So, if you were really here, you could see what I'm talking about. They're both the same color, sort of, but they're not. This is brass, this is gold tone. So, as far as the front... This is how the front of this one looks. And this is its little charms. It's heavy and, you know, just real sturdy brass. And this one is gold tone. And not really heavy, but it's not really light either. And this is the two Juicy Couture bags next to each other. Like, this one says Love G. No, no. This one says Love G and P on the inside, you know, where the doggies are, and this one just says love. The fake one says love G and P, where the doggies are, and the real one just says love. And they both say born in the glamorous USA. And then at the bottom, this one has like the real leather and the little brass knuckle there. This one has nothing, it's just the pleather. And then the bottom bottoms are just like. So then when you turn these around, this one has the J and it doesn't pop out because on a real Juicy Couture bag it usually pops out. And this one doesn't have anything at all. So then when you get ready to open them, this one has a zipper opening, which is the fake one. And this one has a magnetic opening, which is the real one. So magnetic and zipper. So then, as far as the inside fabric goes, they're basically the same. You can't really tell, but for example, the fake one is black inside for the fabric. And the real one is pink inside for the fabric. And then, as far as the tags on the inside go, here they are. The fake one has the big tag, and the real one has the little tag. And then the fake one doesn't have any model number or 
make number inside and the real one has the model number and when they made it the date that it came out inside so those are just some of the differences between um, two juicy daydreamer bags that you know one is fake and one is real and I mean to each its own to your own preference if you want to rock a real bag or a fake one a lot of people have things against you know people that rock fake bags but then I don't even see them with a real bag or a fake bag at all like I don't see them with anything name brand so it really doesn't matter why they talking because they don't even have anything to show so don't sit there and talk about somebody else when you can't even show for what you're even talking about right so these are the bags they're both daydreamers they're both GT Couture and they're both um cute and they're both pink this is the light pink and this is the dark pink and maybe I'll rock this one today this one is the fake one and this one is the real one fake one is fifty dollars the real one I got this for eighty or ninety dollars or seventy dollars I can't remember one of those but it was like fifty percent off I think regular price is one thirty nine ninety nine one forty nine ninety nine one eighty nine ninety nine I can't remember these are at the real juicy couture stores or um, outlets I can't remember if I got I think I got this at the outlet maybe that's probably why it was there and this one I got online so that's the end of my juicy couture daydreamer um, bag look-alike and we'll talk to you later bye Mwah. Mwah. <laughs>